Hey folks, Jimmy Beach here with Alien Skin Software. This What's New video is a roll-up of several cool new features in the Exposure X2 Advanced Layers update. Exposure has offered lens correction for a while now. With this update, we're giving you the option to toggle lens correction on or off. You can also adjust the lens distortion amount via the distortion amount slider. Exposure shows you the lens that it's detected, and you can switch to a different lens profile if you want. New file naming options allow use of capture time for more flexibility. And destination templates automate the placement of photos in subfolders, saving you from having to manually navigate to subfolders each time you upload or export. For example, file naming can use capture time. This is helpful if you want the year, month, and day to be part of your exported file name. You can even organize your folders by capture time when using exposure to copy the photos from your card or export finished images to your computer. This is super helpful if you've got images shot over multiple days that you want organized accordingly. We've added the ability to save presets for file destination and export metadata. There are now built-in presets for commonly used settings in the copy from card or export dialogs. These improvements add up to big time savings when you use those functions. There are a number of speed improvements that all take place under the hood, so that exposure keeps up with you. There are also several new shortcut keys that help speed up common tasks. Command-M on Mac or Control-M on PC moves the cursor to the Metadata search box, where you can filter by metadata. Command-P on the Mac or Control-P on Windows moves the cursor to the Preset search box, where you can search presets. Command period lets you quickly mark or unmark a preset as a favorite, and Command Shift E or Control Shift E in Windows opens the quick export window. We're continually adding support for more cameras and lenses. Support for new cameras from Canon, Fujifilm, and Samsung, along with new lenses from Fujifilm, have been added. Visit our website for a complete list of the cameras and lenses that Exposure supports. We've added Windows support for high-res displays, such as 4K monitors. Exposure's interface now scales according to your display settings. For example, if you're using Windows 10 and you set your text scaling factor to 200%, Exposure will double the size of UI elements to make them legible. This new feature now joins the existing support for Retina displays on macOS. Thanks for watching! If you haven't used Exposure before, try it free for 30 days. From capture to creativity, it's the fastest way to bring your vision to life.